Mr. Rajan Nathai, Foreign Secretary, Government of India. Mr. Wu Hongbo, Under Secretary General, Economic and Social Affairs, United Nations. Uh, Mr. Dinesh Bhatia, Joint Secretary, Ministry of External Affairs. Mr. Nabil Khani, Director of UN DESA. Sajin Chaturvedi, my colleague who's organized this event and distinguished delegates. It's our honor to have all of you here. This is a very important uh, conference on service providers. This is a very important issue, as all of you recognize, and uh, the emergence of the countries like uh, China, India, and many other, you know, we can't call ourselves emerging countries anymore. After the uh, uh, economic downturn, we have firmly uh, set our footprint on the global economy. If the, the, the role these countries are playing in, in, in uh, supporting other developing countries in their development endeavors is something that has come to be recognized to a lower. We thought that uh, it's good for us to take stock of what, is, uh, uh, what has happened thus far, learn from each other's experience, and try to chart out a roadmap in which all of us can work together in a cooperative framework for better uh, realization of the objective for, all, for, 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 for which all of us are working together. Now, as you know that uh, uh, in 2011, at the end of 2011, uh, the Busan uh, conference, the, the Aid Effectively Conference, uh, well, I would say effectively uh, uh, rewrote the entire framework of development cooperation. From uh, what was uh, then uh, an aid effectiveness uh, sort of a, a framework, this was turned into a development effectiveness framework and uh, you know, the, the, we actually looking at a completely different paradigm. Now, uh, the, the parameters of this, this current paradigm are being, are being worked out and I think it's very important for us, of all of us uh, 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 countries from the developing world, to have uh, a substantial say in uh, charting out the, the path that, uh, this, 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 that this, 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 this process is going to take. So, uh, history in terms of assisting uh, fellow travelers in the developing world. India, for instance, uh, started uh, long back uh, in, uh, in the 50s uh, trying to, you know, sort of uh, help the, uh, the, the neighboring countries in their development endeavors. So we have a very strong uh, you know, comment to make when a uh, lot of uh, commentators uh, talk of us as new donors or, uh, or, or countries which have you know, recently emerged on the, on, on, the, on the stage. But we have been there for a very long time. It's only recently that uh, uh, note has been taken off for uh, the contribution that we have been making to partner our countries, actually given prominence to the needs of our Partners. In fact, uh, uh, whatever you know, it's actually demand-driven rather than you know being supply-induced, and, and and that's where we feel that uh, a lot of the problem that has been seen in the traditional you know, north-south uh, 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 development assistance program uh, has been uh, taken care of with the fact that you know the, the whole paradigm is, is, is very different. Um, uh, this is as far as India is concerned, and over the next two days, we are going to hear uh, more of these experiences. And as I said, that uh, our effort is to get all these experiences together to, to develop a framework uh, which, which we can then uh, move, move uh, forward to whichever processes uh, are, 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 are in the pipeline uh, for us to uh, provide a paradigm. Now, uh, I, would, uh, I would say that, uh, uh, that uh, our task is uh, to really catalyze this entire effort. And, and we are really delighted that there have been a number of our friends who have been, uh, with whom we have been talking to over the past uh, several years, but taken time off their very busy schedule to come and uh, join us. And, and this gives us a real encouragement to take the process forward. Of course, when we are taking this forward, 
we would require assistance from all of you uh, to, uh, to, to assist us in our, uh, our endeavor. So, uh, now, uh, I think we have uh, a, a statement and that would provide the, 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 the framework for uh, what we need to do and uh, this will be shared tomorrow. And, uh, and then we would like to have your inputs into strengthening that step statement. Uh, so let me again welcome all of you, uh, very hearty welcome to all of you, to those uh, who come from very long distances to, uh, to come and uh, spend uh, this two days with us. So thank you again and uh, welcome. Let me now uh, invite uh, Mr. Hu Hong Bo, Hu Hong Bo, the Under Secretary General for Economic and Social Affairs 